Here today with Point Loma junior forward Dalton Thomas, head coach Ryan Looney, another junior forward Sterling Summers. Tough fought battle out there today against Holy Names. Dalton, could you just tell me what this team kind of presented for you? They seemed like they really focused on you. They seemed to put a lot of defensive pressure on you guys. What challenge did Holy Name present for you guys today, especially on the offensive end? Um, I think they've been doing a lot of the same things that the team's been doing to us, is just trying to be more physical. Um, and offensively, uh, we didn't execute as well as we'd like to. Um, so something moving forward really in overcome. Sure, I'd like to talk to you about, about that one. You had a couple of really big rebounds out there, and I thought that this game really had a situation of stick to itness, I guess, where it had to play 40 minutes. That team did not give up for it at all. Just talk about the lessons you can kind of learn out of this one as a team as you guys hope for a lot for this season. I think there's lessons to be learned out of this game. Yeah, in that second half, uh, I think we kind of took our foot off the gas pedal and that team wasn't going to give up there. Uh, credit to them for keeping going for 40 minutes, but uh, that's just something we're going to improve on, just playing for 40 minutes straight. Uh, team ball together, playing hard. Coach Looney, how do you get somebody to focus for all 40 minutes? You guys had a chance. I think you guys were about 15 points midway through the second half. Just how, I don't know, talk to me about that one of how you get, how you try to make your team learn this lesson from today's game. I think we were up 16 two different times and then let them uh, back in the game. Um, over the course of the entire 40 minutes, I don't know that we were much different on offense than we have been. Uh, in a lot of our games so far this year. I was really disappointed with our effort defensively. Um, we didn't compete in that area in first game uh, back after Christmas break. Uh, and I think the box score is indicative of that. In our five conference games before this, our opponents were uh, averaging in the 50s uh, against us. And tonight we gave up 74 and allowed them to shoot 60% uh, in the second half. I think simply if we get on the same page and are willing to play a little bit harder, we can be even better than we were tonight. Well, I see the look on both of you guys' faces next to you, and I think that this is, a, in a way, a good thing, that you guys do have high expectations for yourself out there. I guess, Sterling, you guys have one more day. You guys will face Notre Dame, Dana Moore, another team that's kind of scrapping the GNAC, or sorry, in the Pac West, and will give you everything that they got. Just tell me about, like you said, of how you guys come back, improve, and refocus, because you guys have aspirations, I'm sure, beyond just the next game. Yeah, right now, we just got to work on uh, just getting better one day at a time. Um, every practice, walk through, film. We just got to be focused and together and then bring it on uh, Monday night against Notre Dame. Thank you very much, guys. I appreciate it.